The Wankhede Stadium, Marathi, Vanakade Stadium is a cricket stadium in Mumbai, Maharashtra. The stadium now has a capacity of 33,108, following renovations for the 2011 Cricket World Cup. Before the upgrade, the capacity was approximately 45,000. The Wankhede has been host to numerous high profile cricket matches in the past, most notable being the 2011 Cricket World Cup final, in which India defeated Sri Lanka by six wickets. The stadium witnessed the last match of Sachin Tendulkar's international career. Additionally, it has hosted many other matches in both the 1996 as well as 2011 Cricket World Cup. The stadium is also the host to the match in which Ravi Shastri hit six sixes in an over. As of 19 July 2017, it has hosted 25 tests, 20 Otis and 5 T20s. History Early years Mumbai has seen test matches played at three different grounds. The Bombay Gymkhana ground hosted the first ever test in India, in 1933-34 against England. After World War II, the Cricket Club of India Limited's Brabourne Stadium, second ground of the city, was used for 17 tests. The Wankhede Stadium was built after disputes between the Cricket Club of India, which owns the Brabourne Stadium, and the Mumbai Cricket Association over the allocation of tickets for cricket matches. This became severe after the test between India and England in 1973. At the initiative of S. K. Wankhede, a politician and the secretary of the Mumbai Cricket Association, MCA built the new stadium in South Mumbai near the Churchgate Station. It was built in approximately, six months and opened in time for the final test between India and the West Indies in 1975. Since then the Wankhede Stadium has taken over from Brabourne Stadium as the main cricketing venue in the city. It was named after the association's president Barrister Shishrao Wankhede in 1974. It staged its first test in the 1974-75 season when the West Indies toured India. Clive Lloyd scored an unbeaten 242 and in Patauta's last hurrah, India lost by 201 runs. The test also featured a crowd disturbance after a fan who rushed onto the ground to greet Lloyd was treated roughly by the police. India's first victory here was posted against the New Zealand two seasons later. The stadium has been a witness to great innings like Sunil Gavaskar's 205 against the West Indies and Alvin Kalacharan's 187 in the same game in the 1978-79 series and all-round heroics like Ian Botham's century and 13 wickets in the Jubilee Test in 1979-80, which England won by 10 wickets. The highest score by an Indian at the Wankhede Stadium is Virat Kohli's 235 against England in 2016-17. Incidentally Ravi Shastri's six sixes in an over off Baroda's Tilak Raj in Ranji Trophy, en route to the fastest double hundred in first class cricket were recorded on this ground in 1984-85. His unbeaten 200 in 113 minutes off 123 balls with 13 fours and 13 sixes at this ground, is the fastest double century in first class cricket ever since. A. Topic stadium development The Wankhede Stadium was built in 1975 and the first test match played was between India and West Indies from 23 to 28 January 1975. The stadium was built at a time when only test matches were played and with the advent of one-day cricket and 2020 cricket, the demands of a stadium from spectator point of view have totally changed. Since ICC World Cup Cricket 2011 was to be hosted by India, Bangladesh and Sri Lanka, and Mumbai was selected to host the final, it was decided to redevelop the Wankhede Stadium to suit the modern facilities and comfort of spectators. The managing committee invited presentations from reputed architects and shortlisted M.S. P.K. Das and Associates and M.S. Shushi Prabhu and Associates to jointly draw up a project for the redevelopment of the Wankhede Stadium. While redeveloping the stadium, major changes were at the north end and the south end with better facilities to the spectators in terms of bucket seating, large number of toilets and food courts. While MCA undertook the redevelopment of Wankhede Stadium, the ground was not available for domestic and international cricket till February 2011. In order to ensure that MCA did not miss out the turn of test and ODI matches and also to develop a healthy working relationship with the Cricket Club of India. One of the highlights of the stadium is the suspended cantilever roofs. The Teflon fabric roof is lighter in weight and heat resistant. 
There is no beam support for the roof to ensure that the spectators will have a better view. On the roof there are exhaust fans which suck the hot air from the stands and allow the breeze from the west to flow in. The stadium has 20 elevators for north and south stands. Topic. Pitch The seaside situation of the Wankhede Stadium means that the swing bowlers get a fair amount of assistance during the early part of each day. Red soil is used to prepare the pitch, which ensures consistent bounce. Pitch has always been a slow turner. Most of the time it is made result-oriented. It has traditionally been full of runs, but it does help the spinners during the last couple of day, and in the test played on the ground, against Australia in 2004 the ball spun viciously from early on and this, coupled with low bounce, helped India win in under three days even though almost a whole day was lost to rain. The pitch has created many exciting games here with the test between India and West Indies in 2011 ending in draw with both side tied on equal runs. The most recent test match at the stadium was between India and England in 2016, when nearly all wickets taken by spinners. Still the pitch was full of runs, witnessing four centuries, including a double century of Indian captain, an innings total 400 and 600 plus in first inning of the teams. Only. Topic ground facts and figures Capacity, 33,108 floodlights, yes end names, Garwar Pavilion end, Tata end curator, Sadir Naik. Wankhede Stadium is the home ground of Mumbai Indians team in Indian Premier League. Wankhede Stadium is the home ground of Mumbai Ranji team. Architect, P.K. Das and Associates, Mumbai and Shushi Prabhu and Associates Contractor, B.E. Billy Moria and Company. Topic. Various format record Topic. Test records Highest total, 631 all-out by India against England in the 2016-17 season. Lowest total, 93 by Australia against India in the 2004-05 season. The highest partnership at the Wankhede Stadium is 298 by D.B. Vengsharkar and R.J. Shastri for India against Australia in the 1986-87 season. Sunil Gavaskar 11 runs has scored the most test runs, followed by Sachin Tendulkar 921 and Dilip Vengsharkar 631. Anil Kumble 38 wickets, R. Ashwin 30 wickets and Kapil Dev 28. Topic. ODI records Highest total, 438 quarters by South Africa against India in the 2015 One Day International Series, then 358 sixths by New Zealand, 299 quarters by India and Sri Lanka 289 sevenths. Lowest total, 115 all out by Bangladesh against India in the 1998 season. Sachin Tendulkar 455 runs has scored the most ODI runs, followed by Mohamed Azharuddin and Rahul Dravid Venkatesh Prasad 15 wickets, Anil Kumble 12, and Harbhajan Singh 9. T20I records Highest total, 238ths by England against South Africa in the ICC World 2020-2016. Lowest total, 135 sevenths by Sri Lanka against India in 24 December 2017 third match in three-match T20 series, the ground is situated near marine lines in Mumbai. Giroud of England 131 scored the most scores, followed by V. Kohli of India 127, C. H. Gale of West Indies 104. Topic. The stadium has these stands. Sunil Gavaskar Stand North Stand Vijay Merchant Stand Sachin Tendulkar Stand MCA Stand Vithal Divacha Stand Garware Stand Grand Stand Cricket World Cup 
This stadium has hosted 21 Day International ODI matches every time that India has hosted the Cricket World Cup. Topic 1987 Cricket World Cup Topic 1996 Cricket World Cup Topic 2011 Cricket World Cup Equals equals gallery <laughs>